it just hit me that I'm really not blonde anymore. <laughs> I feel sad. It's not forever though. For anyone that like, um, didn't, because when I like originally started talking about getting my hair done, for anyone that like, didn't see that, basically, being blonde makes me like the happiest ever with my hair, but I started to get some really, really bad breakages up at my roots. And as I'm sure a lot of you know, because I don't stop going on about it, I don't have any money to like consistently keep getting my roots done like professionally. So that's why I was always dyeing my hair myself because I wanted to be blonde, it made me happy and yada yada yada. So I really needed to stop dyeing my hair and just let it do its thing and grow out and get healthy again. So that's why I have gone with a colour this dark because it just matches my roots. It looks kind of intense because it's, well, because I've still got dye <laughs> all up my hairline and I've got makeup on. I mean, I'm, it's 6.30 in the morning, so I don't look great. Yeah, that's why I went for a colour this dark because when my roots grow out, it will all be gravy. But, like I said, it's not forever. One day I will go back to the blonde. When, just when I can afford to get it done professionally and safely, like with Olaplex or something like that. But, for now, this is what we're working with. And, if anyone tells me it looks crap, I'll probably cry because I feel like I'm going through a bit of an identity crisis. <laughs> so... Yeah, that's that. Here's a fun fact. So last night my mum was helping me try and um, get some of the dye off of my face with a baby wipe. And she just started then just like taking my makeup off my face for me a little bit. And she was going like this with a makeup wipe. And I'm like, what are you doing? You've got all the makeup off. And she's like, no, you've got some eyeliner under your eye. And I was just like, mum, they're dark circles. So that made me feel great about life. Can't tell you how many times I've tried rubbing away my dark circles too. It doesn't work. This is going to look ten times better when I've got all the dye off though. That's for sure. <laughs> I love the lighter colour. I really do love this colour here. I don't, but I don't love this colour. And that's nothing to do with the stylist's fault or anything like that because I love her it's just my natural colour unfortunately and I'm just not here for it but it's what had to be done to get a good transition with growing my hair out so what you gonna do so I need to go and start editing this vlog and I might have a proper breakfast today, although actually no, I can't remember what I bought, so I'm actually like not blonde at all, am I? Because like this lighter colour is brown. There is no essence of blonde left. It's not forever. We'll get through it. But I mean, where this is just got so much dye still on my scalp, this just looks like a wig. <laughs> I'm sleepy. Does anyone else feel like they have to put on so much makeup when they change their hair like dramatically? Like I feel like I do it every time. Whenever I have a really dramatic hair change, I feel like I have to compensate with so much makeup. <laughs> and this is the first time where I haven't been like shocked to see myself. Um so I think it definitely does make a difference putting on some makeup and I've put on some fake tan but it hasn't really done a whole lot so I'm not sure if it's like out of date or something I don't really know I can't make up my mind whether I'm gonna pop into town before I go to work because I actually have to be at work at three o'clock today um instead of five so if I leave to go into town I probably want to leave about ten to two and let's see can you drag down no I can't see what the time is whilst I'm vlogging on my phone um i was gonna actually film a video today i don't know if i've got the time now though because i need to get some lunch and stuff so i don't know 
Um, but yeah, there's a couple of bits I need to pick up. I need to post some parcels, which I can do down the high street. I need some more body wash. I am toying with the idea of buying some Bondi Sands fake tan because I've got a boots voucher so if I get the liquid gold then I only have to pay £5 towards it which seems pretty good and I still need a top to wear to a funeral the week after next because I don't have anything to go with the trousers that I bought so um, yeah I still need that so I'm not really sure what I'm going to do also been trying to find it clothes to wear on Sunday. On Sunday I'm going to a vintage market fair thing in um, Gravesend. Um, fun fact about Gravesend, that's where Pocahontas is buried. Although I have, have I seen her grave? I think I've seen like a statue. I'm not sure if I've actually seen her grave though, but they have a really good Primark in Gravesend as well. So that's going to be torture not going in there. But it's supposed to be like 30 degrees on Sunday, so like I was trying to find stuff I could potentially wear and it didn't really happen. But, um, yes, I've been drinking water today like a good girl. I bought six of these litre and a half bottles from Tesco and I already finished this one and then I've just refilled it up to about that much because that's almost two litres. And obviously I can't take this huge bottle to work because it just will not fit in my handbag. And yeah, I need to figure out what I'm going to eat for my lunch. And just, yeah, I don't know what to do. I don't know whether to go into town. I don't really feel like it, but also what am I going to really be doing with my life here apart from filming a video? that can potentially 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 wait anyway so yeah i'm not sure i'm also wearing like four different highlighters today to get that glow pop in um but yeah that's pretty much it for now i have a feeling that today's vlog is going to be significantly shorter than the last weekly uh, daily vlogs this week do we see now why I've gone back to dark hair? Because look at how damaged that is. <laughs> That's why we went back dark. But, um, yeah, I definitely do think I need some lightness up here. But I'll wait for a while because I'm broke now. <laughs> Right, so I'm also probably going to wear the same trousers I wore yesterday, um, but not this top. I can't wear this top to work. It's a bit too sexy. I'm going to do whatever. I don't know what I'm doing. What, what am I doing today? What am I doing in life? What's going on? I just don't even know anymore, you guys. <laughs> oh, I do have... A bit of a knot here though. That is not cute. Right. I'll catch up with you later. Hey, I just made some lunch. Doesn't look very appetizing. I forgot to order kale though in the shopping, so it's not my regular stir fry, it's missing kale, so that's sad. But it is stir fried celery, tomatoes, peppers spring onion red onion with chorizo prawns and corn chicken and i think i'll need to take a snack to work because this just won't fill me up <laughs> i am officially an outfit repeater i'm wearing the same outfit as yesterday but with a different t-shirt oh i feel like there's a pain in my chest like like, you know when you do a big, deep cough and it really hits you there? That's how I'm feeling. So yeah, same outfit. Not that you can really see it. But I've got a Primark t-shirt on instead. It's about 10 to 2, so I'm going to leave now. And I'm going to try and get my glasses fixed. Go to the post office, pick up some shower gel, and have a quick look in the charity shops for, for a blouse for... The funeral 
and maybe go to Costa and get a frappuccino or like a smoothie or something. We'll see how I feel when I get there. Hi guys, so it is the end of the day. It's about 10 to 10, I need to go to bed because I've got like a 6 a.m. alarm. Sorry that today's vlog has been a lot shorter than the rest of the vlogs this week, but um, I feel like it kind of makes up for it because I have had some pretty long vlogs this week. <laughs> like, um, I know they're not as long as like the weekly vlogs, but I feel like it all adds up in the end. So, yes, I'm going to wrap it up. I should have left a little bit earlier when I went down to town because I didn't get to go in any shops really. I mean, I, I got to pick up, I went to pick up, um, I got two bottles of shower gel and I bought a new cleanser as well. Um, I went in the charity shop that I used to work in. They didn't have any tops and I ended up just staying in there for a while chatting to people so I didn't get a chance to go to any other shops to look for a blouse and I didn't get to have time to go to Costa either so um, that was a bit annoying. I did buy a blouse on eBay tonight though so hopefully that will be okay. It was about eight and a half pounds and it was um, Jack Will's um what's the word like x something like it's new and not being worn but they've they cut the tags out so that you can't return it it's, i think it's called x x store i can't really remember my ear feels really funny ow but um yeah i feel like not a whole lot has happened in this vlog sorry i'm still trying to make this work I'm trying to make it work but um we're getting there i think i think tomorrow when i wash it i will just need to scrub so much up here to try and get all this dye out <laughs> and then i think it will look a lot less harsh my highlight has stayed pretty damn well too which is good so yeah i don't really have a lot on tomorrow I'll need to edit this vlog, which won't take me that long because it's quite short. And I don't know. I feel kind of. I don't know. I've had a lot on my mind lately. Nothing particularly major. Just had a lot to think about. So. Yeah. Pondering about life, and I really can't bother to take my makeup off. Do you know how much I'd love to be able to sleep in makeup and not have any repercussions of it? Like I hate taking my makeup off. It's literally such a chore. Oh. Bottom of my neck, like the nape of my neck, is so sore from like laying back in the sink yesterday. Oh. Right. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go to bed. My tummy is making some strange noises, but um, <laughs> ow! This is so not comfortable on my head. I don't know why I'm sat with my head on this metal bed frame. Right. Thank you for watching the vlog today. I'll see you again tomorrow.